Thank you, Metroid Alarum, for wasting ten and a half hours of my life. Go to hell, Sakamoto! Hey everybody, this is Lupina09, aka Tyrone's Girl at fanfiction.net. I'm really not sure where to point anymore, just use your imagination. And basically, what I am doing today is, uh, this is going to be a really unscripted episode of Let's Talk Pairings. I mean, look at me, I'm, I'm eating while I'm making this video. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. <laughs> so, basically... I don't know. This is so unscripted. I have notes here. They're right in front of my face, but I can't even think to read them. Hold on. Yeah, this episode is going to be really short. It's going to be really unscripted, and that is half and half because of the time of the day it is, and also because of the pairing that this video is on. So... Yeah, this pairing, this unfortunate pairing that is going to be tied to this video, is the pairing Neji Ga from Naruto. Yes, unfortunately, there's no clever AMV section before we go straight into the meat of the video because I could hardly find any pictures for this pairing. It's that obscure. And sorry if my glasses are glaring. I'm, I'm obviously not in my usual room to do this video. So yeah. This pairing is of Neji Hyuga and Gara Sabaku. Aww. Now, personally, I don't know when people started shipping these two, but I am so glad that they did, because personally, what other pairings are these two involved in? Okay, 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 yeah, 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 in a perfect world, Neji would be paired with Ten Ten, and they would get married and have a bunch of pretty Japanese-Korean babies, yeah, whatever. But unless the, unless the babies end up looking like Korea from Hitalia or Young Sung from Soul Calibur, one through four because Namco is really being a bitch on five. Me not want. And of course, Gar is always, no matter what, no matter how eye rupture inducing it is, paired up with Rock frickin' Lee. No! Yes! Partially! But honestly, why do Happy Go Lucky and Go Away or I'll bury you up to your neck? In San, has to be shipped together. Golly, it, it unnerves me. Golly, just really, really unnerves me. In fact, the only thing, the only reason I quote unquote respect Golly is because it's canon, and I use that, and I'm using that term loosely as fuck in this video. It's only canon. In the aspect that Gara and Lee had that huge fight in the in or, the original Naruto anime that caused Lee to you know have to go through that painful as fuck surgery. But really, since when does canon matter in a pairing? I mean, a lot of the pairings that people love in in Yaoi and anime. I have no basis in in canon. I mean, let me think of some. Let's see. Okay, I can't think of any now, but you guys know what I'm talking about. But yeah, let's talk about some personality and characterization. Neji is, for lack of a better, lack of a better word, a prick at times. In fact, basically... He's Sasuke with long hair. Except that Neji hasn't completely ruined the whole entire anime franchise. 
And yes, I mean that. Come at me, Nartards. And then we have Gara, who, despite being sociopathic as fuck in the original Naruto anime, later on down the line, he matures a bit in some other I stopped, I stopped following Naruto after I found out that Hoshigaki Kisame died in the stupidest way ever. <sighs> but yeah. And in my opinion, it's... Neji and Gara compliment each other. I really just... It's my opinion. Neji has this cool, collected aura about him that, even in the face of a nuclear device, he's just like, oh, I'm too cool to be bothered by that. Oh. And he'll just stand next to Gar and say, oh, he's such a cute, he's like a little cat who's been poked too many times. And then Gara is just, well, he's just Gara. What else can I say about this pairing? See, I've done my research, I've tried, but I, there's hardly even any pictures of Nejiga online. In fact, since I have a tiny bit of Wi-Fi, you guys are going to see me try and find some Nejiga pics. Let me just dry my hands, because laptop repairs are not cheap. Go to DeviantArt. Yeah, that's always a good place to start when you're looking for some... Yaoi artwork. Nezhiga. 172! There are 172 pictures of Nezhiga. Let's compare that to, let's compare that to Gali. Gali. Okay, an error occurred. Hold on. Uh. 4,944! <laughs> 172 compared to 4,944. Yeah, this is fair. This is fair. <laughs> Ain't this a bitch? I mean, seriously. You, you, guys can see, you guys can see how fair this pairing is. <laughs> Well, not even how fair the pairing itself is, but how fair the representation is. Random Nezhiga picture time! Oh, there are, fan there are plenty of fan fictions! There might not be any... There might not be any fan art, but there are plenty of fan fictions for Nezhiga. My two favorite fan fictions for Nezhiga have to be... They are Seat Beneath the Window and Barely Touched Snow by Tanuki Mara. Yes. That Tanuki Mara. Okay, well I guess since... Uh, since... This video is just being so short and so bad, I guess I can summarize the two fanfictions. I mean, there ain't anything else I can do for this pairing, which is really unfortunate. The summaries were so badly done that I had to cut them from the video due to their outstanding crappiness. Yeah, I'm not even gonna try and summarize the story anymore. Just go read it yourself. It's by, Tanu it's by Tanuki Mara. You know it's gonna be good. I mean... She's basically a god when it comes to writing. Naruto, Naruto slash, so. Yeah, go read it. Now. Quit being lazy. Go. Shoo shoo. But overall, I will give Nezhika a three. Ah. <sighs> out of five, because really... If it was a more notable pairing, as in if people represented it more, trust me, this could have been 
This could have been a long video. This could have been like my resume video. It would have to be split up into two parts. But as it is, I could only find enough material for I don't even know how long this video is, but it's probably my shortest video ever. Look, Dragon Girl 11 Kingdom Age, I'm sorry, you requested this video and I pretty much butchered it. I'm sorry, I tried to do my research, but there just wasn't that much to research on. And I might very well redo this video. I, not anytime soon, but I might redo this video. Hopefully, hopefully in a month. Maybe there'll be some more Neji Goss stuff out there. I don't know. But yeah, this well, this has been Lupino Nine, and now I'm signing off. Because obviously, either I am having a lack of sleep or I need to just get off camera because this is ridiculous. You guys have a good one.